hot butt fucks. Once I've got to do it. The Michael Rosen rats. You may think I'm happy, you may think I'm sass, you may think I'm crazy, you may think I'm a woman, but hang on to your fridge and listen right here, I'm gonna tell you something that'll make you keel over and die. <laughs> Me and my brother, we sit up in bed doing the car trip. A hip hop, a hip hop ducks. I'm giving you all the Michael Rosen ducks. I was dead on the 7th of May. I remember very well that awful day. I was in my coffee curled up tight, though I have to say it was as tight as a tight woman. Nothing to do, didn't want to breathe because I was dead. I was so happy, didn't want to leave. Then I hear some people give a shout, one push Mrs. Rosen and he'll be a talking tomato. I'm telling you, that was a puzzle to me. I shouted out, how the fuck do you be a tomato? Doctor shouted, good lord, he can talk. I popped out my head, said, now watch me fish. The project. At school, we were doing a project. You know the kind of thing. Wood sport. Windmills. And we stuck blue strips of paper onto white strips of paper. They were blue strips of paper on white strips of paper. And we kept talking about blue strips of paper and white strips of paper. In the end, I thought they grew windmills and ate our teacher. And suddenly one day, our teacher, Miss Goldgood, said there was an inspector coming in. She said he wasn't going to inspect us. He was going to inspect her. Really good. You know what I mean? And we were all to help her by not breathing. Haribo. Once my friend Haribo came to school, so he didn't know what to say. Then I said, and he just fell over and died. And then he started crying again. He was a man, Haribo's grand. Mind you, my grand was nice too. She gave me and my brother a red shoehorn each. But mine was blue. Maybe Haribo's granddad gave Haribo a red shoehorn each. Dave said, I'm dead. So everyone said, shh. And Dave said, I was only saying. And I said, my grand gave me a red shoehorn. Rog said, I got a pair of trainers for Christmas. And Dave said, I'm my hamster. And Haribo said, you can get ones without laces. And we all said, what? I noticed that my mum and dad were different. This is how it was. I go to the bathroom and I'm cleaning my mum and dad. Upstairs, downstairs, front door. And I noticed that the mum and dad brush is a little bit wobbly. Hmm. It's a little bit wobbly. Hmm. I wonder if it would bend. <laughs> no, it doesn't work. No way. Ah, 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 ah,